all of us, she had assigned chores for us to do. My brothers had to tend to the garden, and every morning was my job to feed the chickens, you know. She chopped, uh, I would chop the green vegetables and mix with the leftover rice, you know, and put that extra the feed and, uh, you know, mix it together. And I had to feed the chickens and pick the eggs. And sometimes when I drop, oh, I had spanking from my mother on my okole because she got so upset because she never let us eat the eggs, you know. Uh, she couldn't afford to let us eat eggs because she had to sell the eggs. So that was hard. And before, and I had to make lunch for all my, uh, you know, brothers and sisters. And because I was, after my sister left home, you see, I became the oldest daughter. So I had a lot of uh, responsibility since, pay, uh, since I was nine years old. I started cooking for the family because my mother was in the laundry wash house all day long. And so I used to cook uh, simple meals because those days we didn't have steaks, so we didn't know how to cook spaghetti. We never saw spaghetti, right, until I started working as a maid. But uh, food was simple and a lot of ve vegetable dishes and used maybe little bacon to stir fry, you know. And so I did the cooking and then um, in the morning, I made lunch for my five siblings. And every morning, you know, chorizo is so expensive today. I want to eat, but I can't afford it. You know, it's so expensive. When we were kids, chorizo, my mother would buy about a huge can. And every day, that's the easiest thing for me to cook. So I would slice it and fry it, you know, crisp, and put it in the bento. You know, we bought the square, the rectangular can. And so I remember one day, Miss Mendonca, my Portuguese teacher, held up my bento in front of the class. I think I was in the fourth, fourth grade uh, by then, fourth or fifth. She held up the bento can and said, look at Fusako's uh, you know, lunch. Every day she brings uh, this uh, chorizo and it's not nourishing for her. And so I was so <laughs> embarrassed. 